Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Libra. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And this is for <coughs> April. This card just flipped over. Claw, be careful. Do not take risks. What else do we have for Libra? Be careful. Do not take risks. Mm, flowers, but it's reversed. So something about happiness. Something could happen. It could affect your happiness. This could be unhappiness. It is in reversed. A message may be coming... Um, may not have arrived yet because the bird is perched nonetheless. So, uh, maybe somebody took a risk and, uh, they don't see something coming. What do we have for Libra? A message is coming. It, I don't know. There's unhappiness here. It is due to a risk. What do we have for Libra? What do we have for Libra? Emotional outburst ahead. Emotional outburst ahead. April. Somebody's gonna I think there's a message that you're that is coming with that because the bird is perched. It has not arrived yet. Has to do with this risk because emotional outburst is right underneath the claw. Ooh. Angel protection. So there is somebody in this reading that has angel protection. There is angel protection here. Somebody's taking a risk, though. And, mm, mm. <laughs> Drama queen. There's a drama queen involved. Hmm. What do we have for Libra? April. April, April, April. Somebody's taking a big wet risk and I feel like it's going to burst because of that outburst. Overall energy for Libra. Destiny. So this is the Wheel of Fortune. It's the Wheel of Fate. So there's a fated event. Something is going to happen. And it is meant to happen. This is destiny. Okay. So this is the spin of the wheel. It's the Wheel of Fate. It's a 10, which is the completion. It's an ending. Underneath that emotional outburst ahead. So there is there is a faded event here that is happening. Let go and let God, right? So I think there's a higher power involved. Let go and let God. God sees all. What do we have for Libra? We have two. Angel again. Your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. So you're protected. There's angel protection here. There's angel guidance here. We have there's angels. We have angels twice. Goals. Progress is positive and personal goals will be achieved. So you will be achieving your personal goals. Making positive progress. 
Congratulations. Let's get one of these. What do we have for Libra? The end of a situation where somebody took a big risk. It says be careful. There is a drama queen involved. Meeting goals. Somebody's meeting their goals. What do we have for Libra? Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. So you have to love yourself first. The Wheel of Fortune is a completion of a cycle. It could be the end of something significant in your life. But this is a message from your angels who are around you. Whether you believe it or not. Love yourself first. You're being divinely guided. What do we have for Libra for April? Take care of yourself first. Don't be uh, trying to fill some drama queen's goals. And get your ass in trouble. You never know what's coming. She does though. She thinks she does. Ace of Cups reversed. There's your unhappiness. That's sad. Emotional loss. Love yourself first. There's a need for self-love. There is a need for self-love. There's an emptiness here. Five of Pentacles reversed. Abandonment. Hierophant. There is definitely a higher power involved. Let go and let God. God is in control. There's definitely a higher power involved. There's somebody here that's not happy. Hmm. This has to do with commitment. There's abandonment. There's neglect. There's victim mentality here. Could be some sort of ruin with that five of pentacles reverse being shut out, cast out, something like that. Not accepting responsibility. Knight of Swords. I don't know if somebody's leaving your life or you're leaving their life. It's on the outskirts. It's on the outside. This is getting out. Moving extremely fast. Getting out of a situation very, very fast. Now, this could be the authorities as well. The Hierophant is the highest authority of all. So I wonder if somebody's getting the authorities involved. I, I heard something about harassment. Cameras, they see it all. They hear it all, too. Temperance. Timing. Now, temperance is a card of evolution, uh, balance, purpose, acceptance, patience, healing. The Knight of Swords, this guy is headed out, or girl, headed out. They're going somewhere in a hurry, acting on emotions. That's the that's your drama queen. Ace of Cups reverse next to the Knight of Swords reverse. And this is speeding. Speeding, speeding causes accidents. There's a higher power involved. It's time. It's time for a change. It's time to accept. It's time to evolve. It's time to go. It's time to go. That's timing. Go. Get out of a situation. It's time to get out of a situation. I don't know if somebody's leaving without saying goodbye. Maybe somebody is being, well, there's divine guidance here. There definitely is. And there is, oh, oh, look at this, okay. Emotional 
outburst ahead. Emotional outburst ahead. Absolutely. There is an emotional outburst ahead. The timing, 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 timing. The time is now. The time is now. The time. And there's something about faith and a higher power and believing and listening. We definitely have somebody has it here that has a direct connection to God. And there's angel protection here. Do not take risks. God, it's interesting that I've said a couple times, God is always listening. Most people, well not most, there's a lot of people who don't believe, right? It's like there's no consequences. Just don't you know? Anyhow, the king of a king. It's a king. Don't look like a king. It's actually a queen. Queen of Swords reversed. Queen of Swords reverse is nothing but a bitch. Nasty, bitter, cold, wicked. She can really wreak havoc on somebody's life. She will do whatever she has to do. The higher power sees all. It's time. Something about, I heard retribution. There's somebody here that is being spiteful, revengeful, hateful. This could be an ex. It could be a wicked stepmother. It could be a friend. It could be a co-worker. This is somebody that is revengeful and spiteful and mean and cruel. Somebody's being cruel. This person is going to have a loss and it is going to be a significant loss. Nasty. Higher power sees all. Now there's a reason. And it's time to go. Somebody's not being honest with themselves. They're not being logical. Not very intelligent. Not very observant. Doesn't have all the information. Doesn't have all the facts. It's too bad. It is what it is, right? Who gives a shit? Let's keep going. Four of Pentacles reverse. I told you it was going to be a significant loss, and it absolutely positively is. Let go and let God. It's underneath God. It's underneath the higher power, and that is a release. It is a significant loss. It's time to let go. It's time to go. It's time to let go. Timing is right in the middle. And then the Knight of Swords on one side, the Four of Pentacles on the other. It is time to release. It is time to let go. It's time to let go of something that is, I don't know, causing you to be bitter? Cold? Cruel? Mean? Anyhow, some, there is a loss. Somebody could be leaving somebody's life because of their attitude. This could be losing a job as well or losing something that was once solid, stable, or secure. Could be a thing. Somebody could be losing something that they had. I don't know if there's something. I mean, the Five of Pentacles reverse could be total ruin, major losses. There's some sort of disgrace here. We have somebody here that is 
doing something I don't know if they're doing something to hurt another person or they're 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 angry they're upset they're this is extremely emotional there is definitely a drama queen here being divinely guided to let go to release to it's time to heal it's time to go it's time to accept responsibility oh. oh my god ace of pentacles reverse now this is definitely some sort of loss it could be like i said a loss of a job loss of stability loss of security it's an unplanned loss I knew it was coming too. You can't be bitter and cruel and nasty and hateful and spiteful and revengeful and selfish and lie and expect to have all the good things. And I'm not saying that's all of you, but the Queen of Swords in reverse is that. And there's overly sensitive and easily influenced. That's the Queen of Swords in reverse. That is somebody that is easily influenced by others. Not logical at all. the end of something there is an emotional outburst that does cause an ending i don't know if it has something to do with wheels or a vehicle first progress to po progress is positive and personal goals will be achieved it's time to release it's time to let go it's time to listen okay listen to your gut if you can it is sad this is definitely sad i feel like it's a sad farewell Everything changes. There's a higher power involved that sees greedy, sees greed, sees selfish behavior. Knight of Wands. Could be dealing with the Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You have Sagittarius in the middle. You have Taurus with the Hierophant. You have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Um, this has got to go, this is getting out really, really fast, fast forward movement. This, and this may definitely be speeding. It's right next to the Ace of Pentacles reversed. I, I did see that today. It's very interesting. In my mind, I don't know who it is, but I got an idea. Anyhow, um, no, no, no. It's, it's time to release. It's time to let it go. It is definitely time to let it go. Anyhow, the Knight of Wands is act now. Think later. This is somebody that is very feisty. This is somebody that is ready, 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 ready. Very boisterous, very proud, very driven. This person is very selfish, self-centered, egotistical. Has some sort of victim mentality. No, no staying power, no practicality either. We have somebody here that is doing something without thinking. They are doing something without thinking. They're doing something to get some sort of instant gratification. 
and it's being seen by the higher power. The Knight of Wands is mirroring the Hierophant, which is God. Leaving fast, leaving in a hurry. There's a shift. There's an exchange here. Something is going down. Something is slipping away or there's a loss with the Ace of Pentacles. We have somebody here that is headed out. Nine of Swords Reverse. This is deep regrets. Deep, 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 deep regret regrets. Be careful. Do not take risks. Somebody's in that Knight of Wands is somebody who takes big risks. I feel like there's somebody here that is doing something very, very risky and, you know, the, the, with the temperance, it's like an exchange. And again, what goes around comes around. So that's very interesting. Anyhow, Nine of Swords reversed is giving deep thought to a relationship caution there's somebody here that does not have good intentions there will be deep 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 regrets deep sorrow there may also be paranoia here as well there may even have a mental illness um deep 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 regrets repeating negative patterns over and over and over and over again somebody keeps repeating they're doing something out of they're acting out of fear they're acting out of anger is a symptom of fear and that's exactly what this is there's an emotional outburst ahead. We have somebody here that is afraid. They're stressed out. They're anxious. They're resentful. They're regretful. They can't sleep. They're trying to uh, do something maybe to gain popularity. There is a rejection here. We have a no answer. Everything changes. We have somebody here that is leaving. I don't know if they're leaving your life or you're leaving their life or they're leaving the establishment or something like that. We have somebody here that is doing something, I want to say obnoxious. major loss won't accept won't accept it's time to accept listen release there's an opportunity here to go in a new direction there's an opportunity to go in a new direction somebody is missing the opportunity I, I want to say blaming as well deep regrets deep regrets there's abuse it's mental abuse verbal abuse could be harassment i don't know i don't know somebody's definitely going somewhere It's time to let go. It's time to go in a new direction. It's time to release. It's time to acknowledge and waking up, waking up, waking up. It's time to wake up. It's time to acknowledge the truth. There's angel protection here. Realizing something with the nine of swords reversed. There's a higher power involved. Everything changes. Something new is coming in as well for some of you. Maybe it's time to and for a new faith or a new belief or it's time to open up to something new. There is a sad farewell here. There's a higher power that is in control. I know a lot of people don't believe, and, and that's okay. 
Um, whatever is happening, it's faded, okay? There's a faded event. Emotional outburst ahead. There is definitely a loss here. We have somebody here that is moving way, way, way too fast. They're doing something without thinking. I don't know who it is, but it feels like there's regrets that come with it. Hopefully it's not drinking and driving. I mean, it could be. Somebody's about, there's a lesson. There's a lesson here. Somebody's about to learn a lesson. They've been repeating and repeating and repeating and repeating and repeating. There is somebody in your life that does not have good intentions. This person has had a loss. This person has had a loss and a, maybe a rejection or something. Do not take risks. It's very interesting. Right at the beginning, I said, don't let them get you. I don't even know what I said because I can't remember. But it was something along the lines about don't let them get rope, get you roped into their mess. Get your get your ass in trouble or something like that. Don't think they'll be able to bail you out because they won't. There's a higher power in charge. It's time to go. And this is sudden. What do we have for Libra? Emotional outburst ahead, the end of a cycle. There's angel protection. A message is coming. It has not come yet. So you can think that it has, but it hasn't. We have somebody here that is not happy at all in their acting on their emotions because they're so miserable. It is sad. It, it, it's immature is what it is. It's very sad. It's, it's somebody that can't master their emotions, that blames others, that doesn't accept any responsibility and needs constant attention. That go on that God, that go on that God, that go on that God, that go on that God. God's going to handle it. This person, this drama queen, is only after money. Drama queen, then we have the money on that card. That drama queen only cares about money. Accept. There's something about acceptance and... Allowing and balance and harmony and making decisions to that will bring peace. Something about peace with the temperance card, you know. Somebody needs help. I mean, I don't know if it's mental help or what. Somebody because of the five of pentacles reversed and then the um, temperance. It's time for a change. We definitely have somebody in this reading that needs help. It's dangerous. This is dangerous. I I'd be very careful. No. The answer is no. It's time to go in a different direction. No. No. 
know if somebody's going to jail or what with that Nine of Swords. Or they're, I don't know. Somebody could get themselves in trouble. It could be a hospital, I suppose. Hmm. Things are going to get better, though, with the, four, with the Five of Pentacles reversed. It's time for a change. It's time for a new direction. It's time for a new adventure. It's time to release and let something new in. There is something new that is coming in that is better than what you had. But you have to believe and you have to have faith. And you can't let bitterness and hate hold you back. And if you're hateful and spiteful and revengeful and nasty, don't expect a damn thing. I don't know if someone's leaving your life or you're leaving their life, but it's time to go. There could be a one night stand here as well for some of you. I don't know who that's for. And somebody could be doing something and they wake up with a deep, deep, deep regrets for doing it. I feel like the authorities are getting involved as well. And like I said at the beginning, there's something about surveillance or cameras. Or maybe it's just the higher power that sees all. Hmm. You know, I don't know if there's something about social media because I just heard something in my head about social media. And it had something to do with those cameras. It had something to do with the cameras. Um, and catching something. What the hell was it? I don't know, it came and it went really fast. Security, security, oh my God, security can't, surveillance, secu that's what security cam cameras are, security. I'm telling you what, if I was you, I wouldn't be taking any risks. I, I'm telling you what, I, I know this and you don't have to believe me if you don't want. Be careful who you deal with. I opened right up to it. That never happens, very seldom. I guess I didn't need to turn the page. Anyhow, you are safe and protected. You are safe and protected. No matter what is occurring in your life, you are in safe hands. Those in the realm of spirit are watching over you. You can relax and let go. I keep on saying let go, didn't I? Once, you, once you've taken measures to protect yourself and those you love, such as making sure everyone has their seatbelt on in the car, what? There's something about a car. I know that there is. And there's something to do with harassment. Because I've been th hearing that throughout this reading. 
Once you've taken measures to protect yourself and those you love, such as making sure everyone has their seatbelt on in their car, make sure your insurance is paid on time, or replacing the filter on your heating unit, then let go. That Those are just examples. If you have been hypervigilant lately, take a break, relax. You know that all is well. You can turn it all over to the Creator. I keep on saying, let go and let God. I mean, you saw me shuffle. God has this whole situation. And I know that. Stop. Good luck.